I, um, I Every couple of months, Jason Morales comes to this HIV clinic in central San Francisco for a checkup. Come on in, let's have a seat right He's not HIV positive, but as a man who has sex with other men, he knows he's at greater risk. That's why he started taking what's known as PrEP, a daily pill that stops him contracting HIV. I would view sex as more of a risk and a liability than I would something that is normal human behavior. So I would refrain from ever engaging in it. PrEP provided me with reduced anxiety and just overall peace of mind. The pill itself, called Trivada, has been used in combination with other drugs for 12 years to help those with HIV control the virus. But its use for prevention is relatively new and it's proving popular and effective. Prior to PrEP coming out, the only messaging we ever had was condoms. And it was basically, you had to use a condom or there was no other way to protect you against HIV in your sex life. And PrEP has added on this extra layer of protection that people can actually tap into. It's a lot more feasible and easier for them to do. In the US, the drug costs about $1,200 a month. But insurance or support schemes mean many of those taking it pay almost nothing. It's here in the Castro at the heart of San Francisco's gay community and what was the epicentre of the AIDS epidemic that PrEP is having an enormous effect. Today, more than 50,000 Americans are taking a daily dose of these drugs and for almost all of them, it's proving effective. In fact, in the last four years, just one person's known to have contracted HIV while on PrEP. The new preventative treatment has been welcomed by scientists, although their focus remains on developing a vaccine. One of my concerns, learning from the antibiotics era, that we may wake up and find that this has a downside, which I think people recognize, but should recognize it more uh, openly, that unless it's monitored well, you will have the emergence of viruses that are resistant to the drugs. Clinics in San Francisco do monitor those on the drugs to ensure they're taking them consistently, and they recommend the continued use of condoms. Many doctors in the US and around the world, though, remain unaware of PrEP and the role it can play in halting one of the planet's trickiest diseases. Tarek Basley, Al Jazeera, San Francisco.